Hey Lightweights and welcome back to some more Red Dead Redemption. Last video was basically solely a Bonnie video. We did a lot of missions for Bonnie, learned how to um, herd cattle, learned how to break in horses, we met her dad, we just had a lot of Bonnie activities. We did get a new horse, I don't have a saddle for it yet, so I think I need to go back to Bonnie. So I'm going to start off this video doing that, but it's not going to be just Bonnie, 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 kind of like last video was. So um, a lot of you have given me some pointers. You told me that I need to get an upgraded campsite. So I am going to try to look into that. Um, you've all asked me to do specific stranger side mission things. I'm going to do all of them, I promise. Um, if you remember my playthrough for Red Dead Redemption 2, I did pretty much everything I could possibly do. Um, I love the world. I love the franchise. You guys love the world. You guys love the franchise. I really want to do it justice. I want to give you everything that I can possibly give you with this game. So I will be doing all of those side missions, all of those stranger missions. You just got to give me time. Um, as you guys know, I kind of like sprinkle them throughout. So I will do them uh, as I see fit. Also, you have already asked me, we're only two videos in, but you're already looking to the next game, which is great. Um, you've asked me to do Undead Nightmare DLC. I will be doing that as well, so you can stop asking. You just got to be patient. Give me time to get through this game, which will probably take a little while since I do want to delve into the world as completely as possible. So please just be patient. I will get to all of those. I promise. Um, if you have specific things you notice I am missing or something that's time sensitive that you're worried I'm going to miss, please still feel free to leave those specific things in the comments. Um, but ge the generic things like, hey, play Under Nightmare or hey, play the side missions, I will be doing those. Um, also, a lot of you have requested that I play horseshoes. So I'm going to try to find horseshoes. It's probably going to be bad, but it's probably going to be fun. So we're going to try horseshoes. Maybe that will be this video as well. I don't really know. We're going to see where the wind takes me. Lastly, posters are up. Took me forever. I'm sorry. I've got like makeup on my hand. I don't even know, guys. Um, <laughs> it took me forever. I'm sorry. I kind of was doing it slowly. I finally got my strips. I ordered a bunch of extra poster strips so that if they ever need to come down again, I've got like two extra packs. So we're good on that front. My shelves are basically done. I do have some lights for behind them. So we are getting to the finished product and I'm so excited. I'm loving it. I hope you are too. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I'll try to post pictures on my Instagram of the final thing for you guys. So thank you all for being patient with the setup transition. Um, thank you for being patient while I was kind of on a social media hiatus. I'm getting back into the swing of things. I'm feeling much better um, kind of figuring this quarantine life out. So work is kind of getting more under control. Stress is just, you know, slowly reducing. So I'm going to slowly get back into um, the social media scene and interacting with you guys as much as possible. Thank you for being patient while I take time for me and take time for my family. I really appreciate that. Um, I said lastly with the posters, but one more thing, the door is open. So you might see a little floofy butt running in and out. Um, Ralphie has been super, super anxious recently. I don't know why we've had a lot of storms and stuff, so that might be it, but I felt guilty leaving him shut out when he's like, I don't know, going through separation anxiety or something. I'm not sure. So I have the door open. So you might see him running in and out of here. You'll probably just see his little curly cute tail. Um, also, if you see me looking down a lot, it's because he's in here and I'm staring at him. <laughs> so um, that might be a little distracting. I'm sorry, but he's hiding under the bed right now. So I don't even know if he'll be in here, but I just wanted to give you a heads up just in case. And I've talked long enough, so I'm going to stop now. But you know the drill. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next video. Here you go, you guys. Oh, hey. My horse, like, magically has a saddle. Oh, there's the horseshoes game. Maybe I should go do that. <laughs> this is gonna be so bad. <laughs> How about a game of horseshoes? Okay. Tossing a horseshoe is controlled by the point of release. You can send a horseshoe farther by choosing a lower release point. You've done this before. To toss a horseshoe, push right stick up and down. You can aim left and right with left stick. Oh god, this is gonna be so bad. What are those little dashes on the side? Oh, 
Oh, release is right trigger. I feel like that's a good angle. Why isn't it going? <laughs> Man, that was awful. I guess I just don't understand. Like, what? Go! <laughs> Why does it I know what I did wrong. I'm pressing right trigger. Okay, this is... <laughs> no, I don't want to bet. Okay, we are not doing this until I have more money. Yes, quit. Oh my god. Can I just have more practice rounds? Alright, someone needs to explain to me how to do that because I was hitting right trigger and nothing was happening. <laughs> that was so embarrassing. Oh my god. What am I trying to do? Alright, so I do have that little stranger mission-y thing. I got another thing for Bonnie. So much to do! Um, hmm. I really just want a Bonnie break. So we're not going to do that yet. Let's go do this American Appetites one again. But we got a stranger right here. Okay, we're gonna pick this guy up, then we're gonna go do the other thing. Work smarter, not harder. Hello! You're pretty. Come on! Hello! Tumbleweeds! Okay, so I actually just learned last week um, that tumbleweeds are a specific plant. Totally always thought that they were just like a conglomeration of dead things that the wind picked up and blew together. I had no idea it was a specific plant. And I also didn't realize like how much of an issue they are. They're like an invasive species. And they cause like horrible wildfires and stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god, my horse, get up. Well, we're just off to a great start today, you guys. Can my horse die in this game? I hope not. Oh, no. Oh, Lord. Okay. Let's go. It's only been a week, but you'd think I haven't played in a year. Oh, they are. Let's get off. Is that them? Hey, this way, friend. Oh, it is. I'm gonna get you. 
If you're game, maybe you'd like to earn a little something searching around about for a few plants I'm light on. Wait. Here's the deal. Whichever one of us gets back here first with the right plants wins on the bet. Nineteen dollars? Shit. What the hell? I'm in. Oh! No, he's gonna get my plant. that those weren't the guys trying to shoot me again. But that doesn't mean they won't be up ahead. Oh. What's that? That's a rock. Not them. Okay. Oh, man. So pretty. Very cowboy picture right now. Excuse me, friend. Mind if I rest up at your camp a spell? Well, it'd be my pleasure. Man needs a break from this desiccated land. Thank you, mister. Mm. Say, what's that stick you got there? Oh. Y'all ain't never seen a dowsing rod before, mister? Never seen a man summon the water up from the bare earth? Uh, mister, uh... Marston. Ah. No. Can't say I have. It's water you're looking for. What's wrong with that lake over there? Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with Lake Don Julio. Nothing wrong with it, but we lack the fancy irrigation equipment you folks have back east. So, man needs a wellspring on his proper tie to ranch here. Makes proper sense. Tar. Yeah. Why, you know, just last week, I was over at Old Pleasant's house. Now, I think I may have found something, but... Old coot that owns a place threatened to call the law down on me, so. People act funny around strange men with sticks. <laughs> they sure do. Damn fools. Bet you he don't even know how much water's running underneath his proper tie. You want me to tell him? <laughs> you know what? You ain't that stupid, mister. And I can tell. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get the old man to sell us his proper tie for a small pittance? Then I can find the source of the water. Build us a proper wellspring. Maybe I will. Well, all right then. <laughs> so we're gonna go take advantage of the guy. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Water and honesty. Hmm. All right, should I do, Ooh, I can't focus right now. Um, all right, let's do this American Appetites one because it probably won't take very long. Come on.
music is getting a little ominous and creepy. but it looked like a snake. I need to make sure that I don't go past the place I need to go. Because I have to go up here. So I think I should go... Cannibals in these pots. My stomach is gonna growl so loudly. <laughs> I just ate breakfast and I'm still hungry. Oh man. Okay, now what? Um. Bell right there. Sounds like the haunted mansion. Definitely a plant. Where was it? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to stop and eat some more. What the heck? This is like class A content, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Cut it out. Oh yeah. I kind of forgot about those. Um... Challenges. Oh, we did the first one. Collect six desert sage in addition to any you may already have. They are found in and around Gap Tooth Ridge. Have you been to Disney World? You know what I'm talking about. Every time it plays, I get the Haunted Mansion theme in my head. Whoa, let's not run this person over. Just a lady sitting alone in a burned down house. Dear, oh dear. Everything all right, madam? It's Miss. Oh. Oh, let me look at you. My gentleman caller. You oh remind gosh. me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I don't think so. 
Where is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo, talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. Must be making things right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. Would you possibly go fetch him for me? This was meant to be my perfect day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. So you want me to go find your Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes, please, sir. I'll see what I can do. Oh. Does she have dementia? Alright, so I can go do that, or I can go pick up something else that's new. Also, we definitely went to this church, Goods Chapel. This was something I needed. What did I need it for? Hmm, search. Oh, that's why I needed it. Okay. All right, I am gonna pause for a minute because I clearly need to eat something because my stomach sounds like an angry animal and it's going to be going crazy all video if I don't eat something really fast. So, oh my God, as I talk, there it goes again. We're gonna search this chapel. Then I'm gonna go search for some food. <laughs> I have never heard it this crazy before. All right, what are we looking for? It's not creepy at all in here. Deadly assassin menu. Oh, is that the outfit? Was that seriously all I needed to do? Easy enough. All right, so I still need to do the Twin Rocks hideout. I need to win a duel. That sounds scary. And keep doing the American appetites. Find me some cannibals. I keep wanting this to be Red Dead 2. And I want to search everything. But I can't. You guys were talking about some chapel with some... This is real specific. Some chapel with some guy. <laughs> is this the chapel you were referring to? And if so, what guy am I looking for? Okay. I think I have found the beast. Although, I was very lazy and rushing, so instead of cooking myself something, I just ate some bread. Because that's what normal people do. Yeah. Um, I don't think I'm going to take the road. I think I'm going to try to off-road it. We'll see how that goes. But that road is very roundabout. Yo! Excuse me. Swindler Blues. Is he sleeping? Excuse me, sir. You need help? Mister, you alive? Fuck, fuck. God damn it. Good heavens. Excuse me? I that said, is something I need no, to ask. No, I'm my not okay. Do I look like I'm okay? 
You look pretty good for a corpse. <laughs> Praise be. <laughs> Move up, mister. Time to get you to a doctor or an undertaker. Whichever you need once we get to town. Uh, St. Peter, open up them pearly gates. I'm coming home. <laughs> Come on, mister. Come on. <laughs> Hurry, sir. I'm bleeding like a badly butchered hog. You'll be fine. <laughs> Just oh, are you? You better take the reins. I don't think I'm strong enough. <laughs> oh, I'm finished. Done for. Just sit up straight, will you? Oh, is this the snake oil guy? Godspeed! Oh, great. What is your name, friend? John Morrison. Oh, good God! Out of the frying pan into the fire! Excuse me? How many outlaws can a man encounter in one day? You must have me mistaken with somebody else, friend. The Baller Twins! Walton's gang! I know who you are! They're back! I'm done for! I'm supposed to drive and shoot. What? Oh, oh God. Lord. Stick to the road. <laughs> we must hurry. Why can't Please. I shoot? There's no time to lose. my friend. We're here. Stay with me. Oh, oh, where the devil are we? Armadillo. We made it safe, you'll be happy to know. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You're a gentleman and a, a true man of honor. Coming from you, I doubt that means much, but <laughs> I appreciate the civility. I owe you, sir. And I always pay my debts. Oh, Jesus. But if I die, I'm sorry for it. If not, I'll be your man for, for. Let's get you fixed up first. Then we'll decide what you're my man for. That was really close, you guys. <sighs> but we did it. All right. Is the store open? Guys, my stomach is gonna growl again. What is happening? Howdy, partner. This is ridiculous. One of railroad big bugs had a pair of red. All right, let's see if this lady's actually getting married or if she's got a little dementia. Biggest thing to happen at Coots of late was my week on the bed. Just so you know, I don't take requests, mister. I'm looking for a man. Name's Peter. Fellow's meant to get married today. Seen him around? 
Who? Peter, is what she said. You ain't after no Pete Turner, are you? For all I know. Where can I find him? Well, my memory escapes me when not properly stimulated. Oh, you dirtbag. And let's see if we can refresh it. Five dollars will do. How about we Or you could stuff? run a little errand for me. What do you need done? It's my wife. She packed her things this morning and left me. The dumb wench is still at the freight station waiting for the stagecoach. If you could convince her to take me back. Her name's Rose. I guess I'll go have a talk with her. Well, you'll need more than talk with that bitch. And you wonder why she left you. Hmm. All right, wifey. Your husband's a douchebag. Excuse me, miss. A douchebag? Er, I don't know, that's a new word. Rose? If that useless, whore-mongering bastard sent you, get lost! Miss, please. If only... You know what? Tell that bastard I ain't going back. Not this time. Not even at gunpoint. You sign an oath, miss. For better or worse. The way I see it, you should give him one last chance. Stop bothering me, you dumb cowpoke, or I'll call the marshal. I can hog tire. Oh god. Crazy thing. Here I am. So did sure. that was that bad or good? I'm confused. Oh, okay. Good. The prompt for if you do bad things popped up and I was very confused. Why don't you and me spend a little time Sorry, but Sorry, honey. I'm a married man. Truth is, Pete Turner ain't been an armadillo for near on 20 years now. Kind of a queer fella and all. Wasn't here every night. Sure as the moon in the sky. What happened to him? <laughs> what happens to all of us? I reckon you'll find him at Odd Fella's Rest. Yeah, that's where he'd be, I guess. I feel bad for her. Alright, so how do I get myself into a duel? Do stores have specific hours of operation in this game? Apparently they do. Closed. Damn. All right. Um. Hello. Get that for me. I need more 
creepy out right now. I don't know if I want to do a new one or if I want to finish up this one. Miss? Uh, what are you doing out here? Um, I'm thinking. Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. On the train from Blackwater. Perhaps. Oh, she was the one with the preacher. Yeah. yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Yes, sir, I was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, Miss. Oh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, she does not uh, look good. All right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So uh, faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. You're trying to move a mountain? Oh, no. Uh, I can't do anything. But with faith, I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. You want me to take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. Oh, I, I get such clarity out here. I see things purely. The world is so beautiful. And full of things that'll kill you. <laughs> including illness. Nothing's gonna kill me, sir. Well, take care, then. Wait, don't I have medicine? <laughs> Not what I meant to do. Not even remotely. I do have medicine. Okay. Get off the... Get, no, no, stop. Oh. <laughs> Where's my... That's not about. Miss Jenny. Miss Jenny. Don't look like the Almighty's much inclined to help you out here. I was kind of worried about oh, you, Jenny. so I brought you some medicine. Oh, oh heavens. Oh, praise you, Lord. I knew you'd save me. Excuse me? You see, it was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. Tell me, were there angels in your vision? 
Jenny. Uh, can I take you back into town? Lord, praise you, Savior. I knew you'd save me. <coughs> Bitch, take your medicine. Will you come with me? Oh, I'm fine here, mister. I, I'm in heaven. <coughs> heaven. Ugh. Can I hogtie or course her back to town? I really don't want to do this one. Ugh. Come on. that I can fast travel to waypoints? My campfire? I think there that's what go. you said. So let's try that. Um, maybe I need the upgraded campfire to do that. You can fast travel to any inhabited location you have discovered. Otherwise, you can place a waypoint anywhere on the territory map and then travel to the nearest road. <gasps> That's cool. I like that. So what does the improved campfire do that I can't do with the basic one? Dude's just sweeping in the rain. Howdy, friend. I didn't know anyone lived out here. Whoa! Now you can't rob the place, now can you? Now get! Friendly old bastard, ain't you? I don't need me no friends, friend. We all need friends, old timer. We die alone, but we live among men. Well put, John. You know, I was... Interested in moving out this way with my family. Would you be willing to sell me a parcel of land? We wouldn't even have to speak or nothing. Land's too dry for farming. Bandits run all the cattle off. Why you want this land? I guess I just like the scenery. Well, I don't know. Maybe for $200 I could give you the deed of this land, find myself a place up in Blackwater. Although I never could stand the people down there. No, sir. You don't seem like a people person in general. Make up your mind. I ain't got all day. All right. Well, I don't have $200 right now, so hold your horses. So we're going to come back for that. I'm glad that I can actually pay him. All right. Um, hmm. I guess let's see what the marshal wants. Oh, that's nasty. Yeah. Uh, oh, and you can save from here. I 
go finish up that snake oil guy too. Who are we killing now? Ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who are getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place Sounds up like near problem. Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. My stomach is still growling. <laughs> I don't know what my problem is today. Hey, wait up! You guys! Go! I miss our game! Alright, boys, let's move it out. Marston, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Nickin. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East, the result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so <laughs> dismissive of science if I was you. Times is changing fast. He's no more a scientist than I am a priest, but people can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, that West Dickens. I can't understand a goddamn word he said. A more flannel mouthed bunko artist I've never met. Look, vultures. I see him. Marston, you and Eli go check it out. Thanks, Eli. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. Hmm. Acquired a new weapon in the same category as one you already own. Check the weapons tab and the pause menu to select a new weapon. That's how I see it. The age old argument of nature versus. God damn nature. it. Come on, let's take a look. Ugh. Why do we gotta kill the horses, Man, too? Or dead bodies. Fire still smoking. Those scumbags must still be around. Come on. Let's turn leather, boys. Looks like they're headed for Ridgewood Farm. Sounds a bitch. Didn't you want to run a gang of outlaws, Marston? Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing a diva is never right, man. boy. No matter how you dress it up. Can't see a soul anywhere. This ain't right. All right, boys, let's have a look around. Ooh, Nobody's in the shed. Blood. But is that animal blood or human blood? I don't know. Excuse 
Excuse me, is anyone pooping on the toilet? No one here! Maybe we should knock first, just in case. That ain't right. No one would board up a barn like this. Break that door down. The rest of you, get your guns ready. Mother of mercy. Please, please don't shoot me. Some bandits came by and took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> this has gone far enough. Get into that house and smoke those sons of bitches. There's the son of a bitch. the shed. Keep your head down. Thank you. I was convinced I was dead. <laughs> oh, oh, oh god. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. There's a deputy waiting for you in the shed out back. Make a Somehow run for it when it's that. clear. Thank you. They said they were going to kill us all. Looks all clear, fellas. Let's check up on the farmers. Excuse me, partner. I ain't getting fresh. <laughs> I like how we talk to the dead bodies. Oh. from these people, but not guilty enough to actually stop me from taking from them. <laughs> Does that make me evil? Downstairs we go. Forgive me, friend. Ooh, what were they eating? Carrots? 
didn't look like carrots at first. Nothing else I can loot? they have here. And by little I mean huge. Alright. Time to go. Rest in peace, my friend. of that bunch gets fifty dollars it ain't about the money marshal these are people's lives people's homes let's go get on your horse boy all right let's I'm find that happened to you but we're not psychic how are we supposed to know you're about to get it come on Let's just say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell are you talking about? Some people I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. It was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. And bear in mind, he's left me for dead the last two times I've seen him. I'm about figuring we've moved past the family part. Walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Bill. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. You know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Bill, we was family! Everybody, take cover! In that shed! This way! Get ready, boys. Here they come. Look what I got here! 
here. <laughs> this shot makes you still no, breathing. How could you turn into somebody like this? Come on, boy. <laughs> Come on, Bessie. Give. <laughs> oh. Norman Deke. Ooh. Fuck. Nice to see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is gonna help us get to Bill. <coughs> Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Dick. Mighty kind. Fuck you! Hog time. Let's get him to jail. We got so many bodies to loot. These are getting closer. <laughs> now what? I'm so confused. I keep hearing bullets, but I don't see anybody. Oh, over there. Closer. Just a little something for my trouble. Okay. I don't know what's happening right now, you guys. I'm just gonna loot my bodies and be on my way. I can skin the horse. Oh. Should I? I don't understand this. who this was or why he was shooting at me. Saved all those bodies. I don't trust that grandma's stomach up in this plant. My fault, officer. Do not know what you do is. <laughs> you okay, lady? drink nor lay with whores and he's been he's been missing for three days let me guess you went missing up in the hills how did you know mister just a guess if i find him i'll bring him back to you but people Ugh. seem to go missing up there oh. oh my god if he 
he's gone, then what'll I do? We ain't got much money. And I'm with a family way again. Oh, no. As I said, I'll do what I can. <laughs> Another bounty poster. Let's go. Let's Come on, easy up there. Pick that up. Cody Whitlow. Mescalero. doing Body part we're gonna find this time. Not again. If they're not shooting at me, I'm just gonna leave it for now. Yeah. Oh my god, you're alive. Please help me. I've been attacked. Oh, 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 mister. Mister. Some city fella just attacked me and broke my leg. What? He broke my leg. Some city fella. Guy got kind of creepy on me. And then he got violent. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Thank you, mister. <laughs> Why won't you people just leave me alone? I feel like I don't trust What's that wrong guy. with you? I think this is the husband. And that last guy was the cannibal. Please! I'll do anything! I know this is not right. Why do I have to do it anyways? This is a nightmare. <laughs> Come on, John. Put two and two together. We are struggling. <laughs> Look at his little run when he's trying to carry the body. Men away from me. Uh, uh, hey, fella. Uh, <laughs> you broke this oh, no. poor fool's leg, mister. Uh, this maniac tried to eat me. We've got cannibals in these here hills. Please help me. What? Please. Fella's got to eat now. Fella's got to eat. Uh, <laughs> save me from this freak, please. Please. John. Uh, oh. uh, 
Well then. Oops. Did we get it? Oh my god, my stomach, you guys. What is wrong with me? Alright, so now we just need to complete Twin Rocks Hideout and win a duel. I don't even know where Twin Rocks Hideout is yet. Do I? I don't think so. Hmm. Not sure. All right. We're going to have to hold off on that then. Alrighty, guys. Uh, we are going to stop there, but I am just having so much fun with this game. I know that I really just did Stranger Missions in this video, but I was just having a lot of fun with them. Um, I feel really bad for Jenny. I wonder if we're going to keep running into her or if that was kind of like the end for her because we gave her medicine but it didn't seem like she was taking it I really really love the missions with the marshal the whole situation with Bill is breaking my heart um, you guys remember from Red Dead 2 how I always felt like Bill was more of a follower um, and he was very much a people pleaser and he did whatever he could to make those around him happy um, so that's kind of why he followed Dutch so blindly He's clearly not a follower anymore, but I didn't expect him to take this route. It's really sad. Um, he was a good guy in Red Dead Redemption 2 for the most part, so it's really sad to, I don't know, see him leading such a horrible gang, I guess. But I'm definitely intrigued by the story. I'm definitely having a lot of fun, and I can't wait to see where we run into Bill next and what mischief his gang is causing. Um, I will be doing Bonnie's next mission. I will be finishing up those stranger missions that I started, and I have a new bounty poster, so we still have a lot to do. Um, I really need to find where Twin Peak Rocks, Twin Rocks Peak, I don't know, <laughs> whatever that at least is. Um, I need to find that, and I need to figure out how to do a duel for that um, outfit, but we're getting pretty close to unlocking that whole outfit, which is exciting, so I will keep working at those. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you did and you haven't already, please make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next video, and as always, thank you so much for watching, you guys. I really appreciate it. Have a great day. Thank you.